Good evening. How are we? Come on. It's hotter than hell outside. Welcome to Sunday evening service in the House of Poetry. Give it up. We would not be in this House of Poetry if it was not for Yellow Cab Tavern. We need to thank them. Link, how many years? Link, how many years have we been here now as Poetry Slam? What? Here? Yeah, the Yellow Cab's been hosting Poetry Slam. How long? Eight. Now? Eight years. Thank you. Maybe at least it may be nine. It's going well. But in Sideshow, I'm still reeling from Sideshow. Jonathan, I think I said last time. I understand why it's near and dear to your heart now. So, thank you for all of that. So, again, Sunday evening service. Why do I call it? that some people go to church on Sunday evenings. It's a gathering of like minds. Um, I'd rather be here. It's a gathering of like minds here. I don't get real political up here, but I'm gonna get religious for a second. How many people are aware of Project 2025? About one in four Americans are aware of this. I just read this weekend. If you don't know about it, I urge you to learn more about it. Um, Roe versus Wade was just a stepping stone, and it is scary as hell. I'm not going to put too much more into that because we've got a lot of readers. I just want to drop that, and I'm still going to be picking on Link to maybe do a poetry revival slam at some point. With that, it's Father's Day. I lost my father about 23 years ago. I went to his grave today. I'm doing good. Um, some people, this is just another day. Link, I know you've been doing Poetry Slam for about 20, this Poetry Slam for about 20 years, and you're also a dad. Happy Father's Day to you, and I know you've mentored at least some of us in 20 years around here, so thank you for doing that. I'm going to read from my new book, Relentless Liminality. It came out February. I've got some copies with me, see me if you want to talk about buying one later. And in honor of today, I'm going to read a section called Father's Day. And she doesn't know it this yet, but Ada, tonight's reading is dedicated to you. Because we've had some chats, and we understand. This is called Father's Day. Even though we walk in our father's shadow our entire lives, the journey ahead is but ours alone. Still, there will always be that shadow figure looking back silently nodding approval and sweeping a hand forward, signaling us to continue on our successful journey, that we have chosen the right path. Just knowing that always makes it so much easier to take the next step. That's Father's Day. My name is Stephen M. Webker. Welcome to Dayton Poetry Slam. And as always, thank you for listening. You can catch Stephen M. Webker's feature from May on our YouTube channel whenever Link gets time to fucking edit it.